it's just a sad tragedy that um, he has to grow up without a mom. It's a sad tragedy that my grandson's in the hospital right now, fighting. An Asheville mother in unbearable pain tonight. Her daughter, 22-year-old Candace Pickens, was shot in the face. Her body was found on a playground this morning at Ira B. Jones Elementary School. That woman's three-year-old son was also shot in the head. He is in critical condition at the hospital. This is an interview you will only see on 7 News. Our Rochelle Spence just talked to the family tonight. She's joining us live now with the very latest. Rochelle. Tom, we are at Mission Hospital, which is where that three-year-old boy is fighting for his life after being shot in the head and seeing his mother shot and killed right next to him. His grandmother tells us he is out of surgery, but that he has lost one of his eyes. She's just hoping and praying that he doesn't lose his life. And we've been out here all day. Let's go ahead and take a look at some video of the scene from early this morning. Asheville officers telling 7 News that someone out on a morning run saw the body and the toddler around 6 a.m. The medical examiner says the mom was shot in the face and already died when an ambulance had arrived. Her son was rushed to the hospital where he's been in critical condition and in and out of surgery. All day, friends and loved ones have told me repeatedly what a great young mom Candace was, hands-on, protective, and always with her son. Tonight, we talked to Candace's mother, who says she knows who did this. The guy who did this is a, such a coward. He didn't have to hurt her like that. He didn't have to hurt my grandbaby like that. He took a beautiful life that I can't get back no more. And all them posts that you're posting, and all those fake tears, we already know, bro, you did it. I don't care how much you say you didn't, we already know, and justice will prevail. But I just want, I hope, all women out there that's gone through some kind of abuse or um, just to get out of it because it's not worth it. My daughter lost her life because of it. So heartbreaking. Asheville police tell me they are just following leads right now. They have not told us if they have any suspect in custody or if anyone has been charged with this crime. And Tom, Amy, to make this even more heartbreaking, the family tells me that yesterday was this three-year-old's birthday. His mom, Candace, her birthday is later this month. And her mom told me she also believes that Candace was pregnant. We are live at Asheville. Rochelle Spence, 7 News.